Thanks, Sebastian. Hi, everyone. I'm Derek, and today I want to talk to you about asymmetry, which is a decentralized protocol for processing and treating sensitive data. And I will show you uh, the, the, the power of the protocol with the first application called DLTEO, running on asymmetry. Everything you will see in the recorded demo was built from scratch by our team now incubated at European Space Agency. What you are looking at here is the burst eye view of the city Mariupol in Ukraine. It is one of the hardest hit regions during the past days in the Ukraine-Russia war. Let's say if we want to find out how many buildings have been destroyed in the past 30 hours, our DAP make it simple and asymmetry make it possible. First, the user switches to the buyer mode to access various data sets. Tap quasi real time where we can see ones available from the past few hours. Let's now tap RVIV SER, which is the commercial satellite data stored on RVIV and zoom in. What we are looking at here is the satellite image of the damage from bombings that happened 30 hours ago. You can see clearly the smoke rising from the ruins. Now let's jump to the analyze part. First, Let's choose an area and select an algorithm from a list of available ones, which can be used on this data set. Let's choose the first algorithm as example and click Compute. What is happening now is the background that the members of the decentralized network are preparing for you to generate the process data as an NFT. This can be now be made available in an NFT marketplace that we are all familiar with. It is basically a special marketplace for NFT-like data computation algorithm where you can buy data from auction or a fixed price. OK, now we pay. And done. The user checks the dashboard, and the estimation analyze is in the user's wallet. The demo I just showed you wouldn't be possible using the, the existing solutions. It would have taken up to six months to gain access of the satellite image, the algorithms, and the compute, compute to conduct the analyze. The Earth observation data industry faces three main challenges. First, access to highly sensitive data set is fragmented, difficult to coordinate, and often blocked by licensing restrictions. Second, even when having the data, analyzing it, it's difficult because cutting edge algorithms are needed, but not easy to find in a fragmented industry. Third, the incentives structure is flawed. Basically, the big companies keep most of the profits while the developers doing the heavy lifting are not rewarded correctly. And the use cases for satellite data are varied, from hedge funds looking for insights into shipping port traffic to agriculture applications to predict crop yields to governmental applications to respond to natural disasters or defense concerns. The specific application is super cool, but it is nothing compared with the potential applications asymmetry enables. Combine both data with wide access to knowledge and a, and a correct mechanism design, and what you end up here is a knowledge economy. Let me show you how our protocol works. We have four types of user that make up our ecosystem the data provider, developer community, computation provider, and the end users. A data provider stores raw data on RVIV. Our protocol asymmetry interacts with RVIV. The developer community provide algorithms stored as NFTs, while the computation provider take the algorithms and use them to compute the data stored on RVIV. The result of the analyze is then delivered to the end user in the form of an NFT. The end user pays for the cost of this analyze process with our token. And, and de developers, computation, and the data providers get rewarded for their contribution. Given that it is stored on RVIV, developer basically code once and earn a passive income. Computation providers plug to earn, and the data, data providers store to earn. Now let me show you how encrypting the raw data the algorithms used to analyze the information and adding computing all creates a new computation paradigm.
let's now take a look at what raw data encryption plays into all of this. Given the sensitive and the licensed nature of the data, by adding privacy enhancing technologies such as 40 homomorphic encryption, we allowed anyone to help you to process your data without needing decryption so that your data remains encrypted and controlled by yourself throughout the process. So when data provider upload encrypted raw data, the developer also upload encrypted algorithm so that the computation provider could compute on top of them and generate a encrypted secondary data product, which also remains encrypted until the transaction is finalized. SmartWave is ideal for us because it could really unleash the potential of a smart contract and run heavy computation on top of it. So essentially, we are democratizing data and monetizing data by a new computation paradigm. The team behind the protocol has a great mix between blockchain architecture, cryptography, mathematics, scientific research, and the GIS to make sure we can deliver our vision. This is the reason why European Space Agency have been funding and incubating our project from the past month and why we received the third place prize from the German Aerospace Center in their Inner Space Master Challenge last year. Our roadmap for this year envisions fundraising in Q2 to develop our layer two solution on SmartWave, in Q3, launching testnet of training functions and launching the alpha version of the layer two solutions for the compute component in Q4. And we are looking for new members now. So if you are interested in what we do, come find our booth after the presentations and do not forget to follow us on Twitter. Thank you very much.